Thinking of buying a new iPhone? Unsure if all your data will transfer during setup? Concerned about losing photos or files if you sign out of your Apple ID? Here's a quick guide to what happens when you sign out of Apple ID and how to protect your data. Part 1. How to sign out of Apple ID. Open settings. Tap your name. Scroll to sign out. Enter your password and tap turn off. Select data to keep, then tap sign out to confirm. Part 2. What happens if you sign out of Apple ID? After signing out of iCloud, you won't sync data like photos or contacts. Existing backups stay, but new data won't be saved. Some apps may lose iCloud features and require you to sign in again. 2. Photos. After signing out of iCloud, you can't access or sync photos and videos across devices. You won't upload new content to iCloud Photos, but you can still view locally stored photos on your device. You can't delete them from iCloud. 3. Apple Music Signing out of Apple ID removes access to your Apple Music library and playlists. Offline music may not be available, though it stays in iCloud. Syncing, play history, and subscription management will also be unavailable. 4. iCloud Mail Files and Documents if you sign out of your iCloud account, you will no longer be able to access your iCloud mail account and will not be able to receive or send emails. 5. Apple Wallet After you sign out of your Apple ID, your Apple Pay account will no longer be available, and any added credit, debit, or transit cards will be temporarily disabled. 6. Imsage and Facetime You won't be able to use Imsage with your Apple ID. But you can still send and receive messages using your phone number. Messages backed up to iCloud will remain. 7. Apps and App Store You can still use previously installed apps, but you won't be able to purchase or download any new apps. You also won't be able to update any available apps. 8. Find My App You won't be able to use Find My to track the location of your device. You won't be able to enable lost mode to lock your device or display a message if it's lost. Part 3. Steps to take before logging out of your Apple ID. Before signing out of iCloud, back up your iPhone data. We recommend using Mobikin Assistant for iOS to securely transfer your data to your computer. It also helps restore the backup if needed. Step 1. Install and launch Assistant for iOS on your computer. Connect your iPhone to the computer and follow the prompts on the tool's initial interface. To ensure that your iPhone is correctly recognized. Step 2. From the top menu, select Super Toolkit and click iTunes Backup and Restore. This will open the iTunes Backup Management window, where your connected devices will be listed. Click Backup to continue. Step 3. Select your iPhone and select the Backup Files to default iTunes Backup Location option. Finally, click OK to start backing up your iPhone to the iTunes Backup Location. To back up specific iPhone data with Assistant for iOS, select the data type from the sidebar, preview it, check the items you want, and click Export to save to your computer. 2. Disconnect all devices from iCloud. Open Settings, iCloud, Find My iPhone or iPad Mac. Turn off the switch for the device you want to unlink. Then select Remove from Account to confirm. 3. Sign into iTunes. If you have downloaded music from the iTunes Store, remember to sign into iTunes before signing out of your Apple ID. This ensures that you can still keep and access the music files you have downloaded.